Today I'm going to be showing you how to do an everyday makeup routine. This is my go-to makeup routine from whether I'm going shopping with friends or going to the movies or work, uni, anything. It's simple and it's easy and it looks so cute. So it's perfect and make sure before I jump into the video, make sure you like, comment and subscribe to my YouTube channel and check out my Instagram. I'll put it right here for you. And so without further ado, let's begin. So to begin, I start with the Mario Badesco Facial Spray with Aloe Vera Herbs and Rose Water. I just spray it all over my skin and make sure I rub it in with my fingers to make sure it gets all over into my pores, ready to prep my face for the foundation. So then I go in with the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade Classic Ivory, which is number 120. Now I put like a little pea-sized bit on the back of my hand and then I use my Beauty Blender to, put it, to pat it into my skin. I put it all over my face, starting with my under eyes, and then I make sure I go down the tops of my neck as well into my hairline as well, because you don't want to have a different color skin tone to your face, to your body. So I make sure I get it all over so it looks as natural as possible. So I blend that in. <music> Once that's all blended in, I then go in with the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade Light. And I put it in like a triangle under my eyes just to hide the bags and things, just to make me look more awake as well. And then I blend that out with my Beauty Blender as well. I use the Revlon Color Stay powder in the shade medium deep with a big fluffy brush and I brush that all over my skin it just gives me that airbrush foundation look to make sure it's not streaky or anything like that and just pats it in and make sure it looks as natural as possible so that's perfect now make sure I focus it on my under eyes as well to make sure it doesn't crease as well. <laughs> So now I go in with the Smashbox Draw In Deck Out Sculpting Cheek Palette, which I believe was they released last year as part of their Christmas collection. And what I do is I just mix the contour and bronzer colour together and go in like a three on my cheek. So I start at the top of my forehead, under my cheekbone and then under my jaw as well, just blending that out. So the Too Faced Love Light highlighter in the shade Blinded by the Light and I use that just on the tops of my bones just to highlight and I go just by my brow and down as well. So you have that perfect popping highlight. <laughs> So after highlight, I go in my, mod my Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance Eyeshadow Palette. This palette is seriously amazing. You can create so many eyeshadow looks with it. And so for today, I am mixing Golden Orca and Raw Sienna, which is the two browner shades in the palette. I mix them together and I, I blend it into my crease, mainly, mainly focusing it on the out corner and just brushing it into the inner corner. finish blending I will just wipe the eyeshadow just to make sure it's got a cleaner edge to it 
Now I flipped the brush and now I'm going in with Cypress Umber. I'm just focusing it on the outer corner of the crease just to darken that a little bit and then just working it into the center a little bit more. Just blending that out. Now with the flat side of the brush as well, I'm going in with the shade Vermeer, which is the highlighting, highlight, shimmer shade of the palette. And now I'm focusing that one mainly on the lid, closer to the corner and bringing it out gently to the outer corner. So now I'm going back in with the first two shades we use, the Golden Orca and Raw Sienna, just to blend that together. So I just go through and just do a few touch-ups, adding that highlighting shade to the corner of my eye as well, the tear duct, just to make me look more awake as well. And then I go in with the Better Than Sex Too Faced Mascara, which is absolutely amazing. Highly recommend this one. It's my second tube I've gone through, so I love it so much. And I just focus out on my eyes making sure I do the top lashes and the bottom lashes. And my last and my favorite part of this is I use the Kylie Jenner Naked Liquid Lipstick from the Vacation Collection. So I put that on my lip and make sure I outline it, then fill it in. Yeah, it's the perfect nude lip. Absolutely love this shade. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and make sure you like, comment and subscribe to my YouTube channel and I'll see you in my next video. Love you all.